So here's what I bought on that Monday when the Cars 2 merchandise was made available for sale. Lightning McQueen with racing wheels. I got this little guy for my red, white, and blue collection. And I got the Cliffside Challenge track set, which we're going to open up and check out. Oh yeah, I got cereal too. Okay, so shoot me. First off, Lightning McQueen. He's a version that has the uh, the plastic front piece so that they can make different expressions. And this guy, I don't know, I don't know. His, his name might be Raul Carul. I don't know. Haven't seen the movie yet. I'm curious how they compare to the uh, weights. Here I have Lightning McQueen. I got my scale. I'm curious if they uh, if they reduced any of the weight or if they're di or as a matter of fact, let's see. This one came out of the Target set. Remember that big box set that had uh, had these fan guys in there. So uh, he actually has a metal face. It is the one piece that is not the plastic. So let's check out how much he is. 53 grams. And here's the new uh, World Grand Prix version. Grand Prix. 53. 43. 10 grams less. But, but don't forget, this is not the plastic the one with the plastic mouth. Here's the one with the uh, plastic uh, face. Uh, I think a Burt McQueen. I don't remember the name. So this guy, the new one is 42. 43. 42. And the plastic face version before is 48. So somehow he lost weight again. Keeps losing more and more weight every time he's uh, released. But yet the price uh, stays the same. Uh, I'm looking at the size. They seem to be about the same. Seem to be about the same length and same width. But uh, anyways, let's go ahead and check out the uh, Cliffside Challenge track set. So the track set is basically a two-lane racetrack. They come racing down. Comes with one vehicle. Uh, I like how these uh, boxes, they're textured. They're just not a square box. Got this uh, cut to it. Um, there's other play sets. Four different ones. Says uh, they, they all four connect. Kind of like the uh, Toy Story 3 to where one triggers the next action. I'm not sure how it does it. I'm, I'm looking at the box here, and I, I don't see, I don't see how it would connect. But uh, let's open it up. Well, the first thing I did is just uh, dump all the parts out of the box, and you know what? Uh, from past experience, all these little parts uh, could not be good. I don't know. Here's this guy. Comes with the track set, but uh, hopefully everything stays together well. Let's see. So here it is all put together. It's about two and a half feet long when it's done. I put the World Grand Prix sticker on the uh, front here, but I didn't put the other stickers on. So uh, here's some of the features. Here's the start gate. I put one guy in right here. Let's go ahead and put the McQueen that I opened up that sold separately in this uh, starting block. And right in the middle you have a little uh, drop gate. So let's go ahead and start. This lane has a little uh, trigger here. Every third time, it seems to me every third time that the car comes down, the curve here is going to open up and cause the car to crash, make it fun for the kids. The tracks mention that uh, they connect to other ones to, co to do a chain reaction. So this, it looks like you put the other piece right here to connect, and then when the car comes down and hits this arm, it causes the cars to go, it will cause this to actuate. Oh, he didn't crash, he didn't fall through. Let's go ahead and put three cars down straight in a row and watch the trigger.
all in all, not a bad set for the price. Have fun. Bye-bye.